Well, Thank Idaho you. playing a critical role tonight in the Super Tuesday contest. 32 delegates are at stake in a state that hasn't chosen a Democrat for the White House since 1964, going for Lyndon Johnson back then. Joining us now, Senator Mike Crapo of Idaho. Senator, great to have you with us. Uh, Idaho uh, going to have a big voice tonight. Uh, how do you think it's? Uh, how do you think it'll work out there? Well, Lou, there's a lot of excitement in Idaho. This is the first time we have had a caucus rather than a primary vote. And it's also the first time that we've held this, this caucus on Super Tuesday. I think you're going to see a tremendous turnout in Idaho. And uh, frankly, it looks like uh, Mitt Romney has the support there, but it's not clear. It's going to be very interesting to see how it plays out during the night. Now, Idaho, a quarter of the population, by some estimates, is Mormon. Uh, that's a pretty handy advantage, isn't it? Well, you know, religious affiliation doesn't guarantee how people will vote, but uh, Mitt Romney is very popular in Idaho, and, uh, and I ex expect that if you have a representative turnout that he will do very well there. The question is, though, uh, how the caucuses will work, because really it just depends on who shows up for these caucuses, whose team is the best at making, you, making sure that their supporters come out and get involved. I think nationwide we have to say that uh, Congressman Ron Paul's uh, shown some considerable uh, intensity and uh, effectiveness in caucuses, his supporters certainly. Uh, do you think he has a shot of winning? Uh, he seems to think he does. Well, he would definitely be the, the next main player in Idaho, other than Mitt Romney, in my opinion. He's very popular in Idaho, and he's been to Idaho two or three times, has been very, very aggressively seeking the Idaho support. And uh, in terms of tur turnout, how, how, big are, how big is everybody suggesting the turnout will be in Idaho tonight? Well, you know, we have no idea. This is literally the first time Idaho has held caucuses for the Republican primary decision. And so uh, we'll have to answer that afterward, Lou. I really wish I could tell you. Well, this is going to be kind of fun to kind of uh, learn along with everybody else what's going on in the great state of Idaho. Senator, it's it great will. to have you with us. Thanks so much. Thank you.